crave warm comfort food and nothing hits the spot like chicken pot pie. Oh, that just sounds good when you say it. <laughs> Chanel Chef Gernard Wells is a cookbook author, host of the popular show. It's called New Soul Kitchen. It's on Clio TV. And you're here today because you're about to share your mama's homemade recipe. This is big that you're revealing this for us. And the QR code, of course, is right there on the screen for ingredients and the rest. How are you? I am good. Happy New Year's, Happy guys. New it Year. is so good to be back. But yes, this is my mother's signature pot pie recipe mm. um, that I highlight out of my cookbook. And one of the things I love saying about this book, it gives you all of the vegetables. So, you know, we got us some nice good carrots. Mm -hmm. I always say you dice them. A lot of people wonder... How do you dice a good carrot? Yeah, First, do. you slice it down the centers, lay it on the side. You can cut it on again. The flat side, or right. you can just line them up and pop, 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 pop. pop, pop. pop. There you go. It's it's like that that's simple. To watch yes. It. Then from there, it's all about the fillings. We got okay. potatoes, we got green onions, we got sweet peas, we got carrots, all of those. Is that you, celery right there? Yes, it celery is. Too. Flavor okay. on top of flavor with garlic. Okay. So this goes right into our pot over our chicken here. Okay. You're right. See, so you caught that one right there. One. Yes, yes. So in Cajun seasoning. Now, oh, first you want wait, what now? Cajun, Cajun seasoning. seasoning. Now you know I'm a Southern boy okay, growing up. I gotta go ahead and add the peas in it. Yes, okay, yes. Okay. Now when you saute your chicken down, you got that flavor from the chicken. You add those vegetables. So you you kind of cook the chicken down a little bit before you throw the veg in. Yes, you do. You do. Okay. And then this is the thing I always say: people love shortcutting at home. Yeah. If you don't want to go to cooking your chicken, go to your local grocery store. Find chicken that's already cooked, got the flavors. Just pull it, it up. Add your vegetables. Okay, so everything. now what okay. are we adding? Now it's about the roux. We got the chicken roux. stock. We got chicken. Oh, we got chicken down. stock. We want to add that in. But now okay. for your roux, eat, go ahead, add it What's in. What's in there right now? Equal parts flour and butter. Flour and butter. Flour yes. And butter. You know, a lot of people, depending on where you're from, you'll call it a roux or you may call it a gravy. No. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yes. On. Then grab me a little of that heavy cream there. Heavy. Uh -huh. Let's get it in. We're making magic uh -huh. here. Uh -huh. And when I would watch so my mom in the kitchen making this, it was it was like heaven, especially walking in. Yes. You smell it, add a little kosher salt, cracked black pepper, okay. green onions. We want to get all of What's this that? in. It's all, yes, it is. All of this. What's flavor. that last What's little piece? Look, look at this. You, you know that? what that I is? Rosemary. Oh, look I love that. rosemary. Yeah, let your nose talk to you uh, in the kitchen. Let your That's nose talk to me. I'm and once mouth you talk blend to it to together, too. you start getting getting this right so here. It's thick. It, it should be yes, thick. Yes, thick. Because see, we know what's important with a good pot pie: what? the creaminess, the filling. But see, you're talking about crust, so they go go together hand in hand. You've already poured that in there. Yep. What what you do is once you get everything I together, you got your My chicken, God. you got your pot. So you you fill up these you guys. You fill up your ramen because you can do ramekins, you can do bowls, whichever oh, you like here. Delicious. Then puff pastry. Oh. Is that or just like you can, can you can get that in like a, just in the refrigerated section? Yes, it's done about and done. saving time. I want to add more value yes. to your life. I say you should eat good. And have I like time these too. individual and you guys. can take you a nice good fork, do the indentions around the sides to uh -huh. make it stick. Make, oh my goodness. Then look, to let it breathe, because okay. you don't want it to just bubble Explode. over. Boom, boom, little boom, thing. little slits. Or as my mother would do, she would be yes. funny with it. She would actually cut and make some J's in it. <laughs> she was like, Janard, that's just for you. Now, oh my how gosh. long do you cook it? These right here you want to cook for roughly about 20 minutes, because remember, everything is done. Your chicken is done, oh, your sure. vegetables so is done. Just, just so you're just browning and making it marry oh, to come like together. I can make a big one too. I know, right? For yeah. the family, and that's yeah. how I look. I come from a big family, it so is, yeah. it was all about saving Delicious. time and money oh, at the same pie. time, giving you that love. And it was almost like a big hug. Go ahead and get into oh, it. You know it I'm going to get into Delicious. it. Delicious. Yes, now look. Tell us about this berry salad. Berry salad. I always say with a good pot pie or any savory dish, you want to have that greenery. And me, okay. growing up on a farm, look at that. Look mm. at that. See? That's what that's what, that's Gennard. what you want. Gennard. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Mm, thank you, Jim. So, girl, growing up in the South, it's always important, as I say, to have nice greenery to balance everything. Yeah, because right. we got a lot of vegetation. Yeah. So, making our oil, you got honey. Mm. Oh, you make you it? Got, you got olive oil, or you can use avocado oil. Okay. Mm -hmm. Also, you can substitute your honey for agave, depending on. on what sweetener you want and here. And a little balsamic? A little balsamic in there to bring it together. Whisk Boom, that up. whisk it together. And now we're making our salad dressing. Okay. See, that smells salad so dressings good. is not hard. No. You know, a lot of people get intimidated by yeah. yeah. Cooking is your friend. It's that zen moment. And what I like doing, we take these fresh vegetables. Okay. Come on in here. We got, we got our arugula. Yeah. That arugula gives you that nice peppery feel. Mm -hmm. We got our berries here, our strawberries. All of mm -hmm. these you can get at Yummy. any given time. What kind of cheese you, do you like to use? Oh, this right here, I love a good mozzarella. Mm. mozzarella. Nice, fresh, light, mm. delicate. You want to just bring it in. Mm. You this add your walnuts. Gennard, the walnuts add something special. It adds character like me. You can uh. coordinate. <laughs> 
<laughs> All right, guys, delicious. Get this recipe. Yummy, delicious. Thank, thank you, Janard. Thank you so Go much. Go to today.com slash food. Today takes you inside.